I'm Callie Lewis. You're watching Geek Brief TV. This is Brief 612. It changes from time to time, but for the most part, we release four briefs a week, 48 weeks a year. Usually we shoot Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. We set Wednesday aside to do interviews and marketing. Now, there's no reason in the world you guys should care one bit about that, but I've been doing this for four years and I just realized this week that the technology we're all using is finally at a level that makes it easy to do something now that used to require a hacked together solution. In radio and audio podcasting, there's a recording concept called the double ender. It it sounds kind of kinky, but really all it means is that I record my audio and you record yours during a conversation on the phone or Skype. The two recordings are edited together and the end result sounds like both people are in the same studio. I've been wanting to apply the double ender concept to video interviews since our first year and this week I did one with Amber Mack for a new show she's doing called Girls Go Geek on Xbox Live. We also did one with Channel 9 News in Denver. Of course Amber gets it, she's a geek, but I'm really happy to see a mainstream news organization give it a try. Here's how it works. Amber set up her lights, camera, and action in Toronto. We set up mine here. She shot her video, I shot mine. She recorded her audio, I recorded mine. Amber interviewed me on Skype, and rather than being on a webcam, we routed our camera to Skype using the Infinity Pro card that I installed last week. Also, rather than putting Amber on a regular monitor, we put her on the Pro Prompter monitor, so I was able to see her face while looking straight into the camera. It made the whole experience feel more like a natural conversation. When we were done recording, we uploaded the videos for Channel 9 Denver and Girls Go Geek to an FTP server so the two production teams can download them and then edit them together. The final product can be a higher quality than we would have achieved with a really expensive satellite uplink. Now, for breaking news, satellite will be the solution in electronic news gathering for years, but when a reporter has some time to put together a story, this kind of setup starts to make a lot of sense and potentially saves news organizations thousands of dollars. I think I've done an okay job communicating that I'm excited about the possibility here, but maybe not such a good job explaining why you guys might be too. Well, in the back of my mind, as I'm realizing all this, is H-A-R-O, which stands for Help a Reporter Out. The thought behind the project is that everyone is an expert at something. Reporters need sources. Help a Reporter Out connects experts with reporters. If you're an expert wanting to promote your blog or your business, what better way than to be able to provide broadcast quality video to a reporter who might be in a completely different part of the world? This brief was brought to you by Squarespace.com, where you can find everything you need to get your business, blog, or personal project up and running on the web. My promo code GEEK will save you 12% and supports the production of the brief. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Callie Lewis. Bye. Or as I said on a previous brief, bye.